Hello Capricorn, welcome to Spiritual Butterfly. Today I will be doing a reading for Capricorn singles. We are going to look at who is coming towards you, what they want, and how will the relationship end. These messages are general, they will not resonate with everyone. Take what does, apply it, and leave the rest. Also, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click that notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. So let's jump right into the reading Capricorn and see what messages Spirit has for you. So Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn? Messages for Capricorn. Who is coming towards them? I have the player and I have air signs. So for some of you, this is an air sign, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. And this person is a ladies man. Yes. This person is very attractive. They get a lot of attention. Spirit, tell me more about the ladies' man. I have the Seven of Swords and I have the Ace of Cups. I feel like this person is going to hide their emotions, how they truly feel about you. They're going to hide how they truly feel. This is not going to be someone that's going to open up very easily. For some of you, because they get a lot of attention, this may cause you to pull back. You may feel that they're seeing other people. But I heard not entertaining anyone. I feel like this person is not going to be seeing anyone else. It's just going to appear that way because of the attention that they get. Like you're going to feel like they're hiding something from you. But in actuality, this person is serious about being in a relationship with this Ace of Cups. This person wants to pour, wants to give to a connection. But you may not believe them, Capricorn. You may struggle believing them because of the attention that they get. The amount of men or women that's attracted to them. Spirit, tell me about air sign. I feel like this person is just like a very logical thinker. Thinker, I'm getting like the King of Swords energy. I heard they have a good head on their shoulders. I have the Ten of Wands in the reverse. This person has nothing to hide. Like anything that they were dealing with from their past has long been gone. Like they have cleared the way. They have made room for a new relationship. Yeah, this person is going to be single. But you're going to have a difficult time believing that. So let's see what they want from you, Capricorn. Yeah, this person doesn't have any baggage. They don't have anything they're going to be dealing with. That will cause some type of confusion or chaos. When it comes to this connection. But I do feel like this person is going to hold back from you at first, Capricorn. And you're going to feel because they're holding back that they have something to hide. But in actuality, they have nothing to hide. Spirit, tell me what this person wants. I have compromise and opposites. I feel like this person is going to want to make things work with you. With this compromise, they're willing to do what it takes to make it work. With this opposites, you and this person may come from different backgrounds, religious backgrounds. You may be from different cultures, um, a different ethnic background, race. So there's going to be some type of difference between you and this individual. But I heard opposites attract. Yeah, I feel like there's going to be a very mutual attraction between you and this person and they're going to want to meet in the middle to sustain this connection they're willing to do what it takes capricorn i heard serious about you yet yeah, this person is going to be very serious about you i heard they're going to want to make you happy okay spirit nine of cups in the reverse 
there's going to be a challenge when it comes to this connection and i feel like this challenge is going to be the difference between you and this person so whether it's race it's culture it's religion it's going to be very challenging for you to overcome this hurdle but i feel like you're both going to be committed to doing so spirit tell me about this nine of cups I have the eight of wands spirit says communication is key in order to get over this challenge communication is going to be very important when it comes to this relationship both of you being able to see eye to eye both of you being able to agree both of you understanding each other more also, her lifestyle, for some of you, you may come from two different lifestyles. Um, one of you may have grown up, you know, in the struggle, <laughs> you know, having to, you know, pull yourself up by the bootstraps. You may have come from poverty while the other person came from a lifestyle that was very affluent. But there's definitely going to be a very significant difference between you and this person. And communication is going to be very important in order to overcome those differences. But this person is going to want to compromise. Like they're willing to do what it takes to make it work. So let's look at the outcome of this connection. How will it end, spirit? How will it end? Okay. Oh, I thought something flipped over. <laughs> I have planning. For some of you, the issue may be making time for each other. You may live apart. You and this person may live in different states, possibly even different countries. But yes, making time for each other may also be a challenge. With this planning... How it's going to end is that you're both going to try to make it work. Whatever the difference is, you're both going to be willing to make it work. To work through whatever challenges you face. So let's clarify planning. Yep, the three of wands, somebody's going to have to travel. <laughs> somebody's going to have to travel, making time for each other. Also, this person may work a lot. I have the ace of pentacles in the reverse. This person may work a lot. Yeah, this person may be trying to climb the corporate ladder, trying to become more financially stable. They may work a lot. Their job may cause them to travel a lot. So you making time for each other is going to be a very significant issue. But I see both of you doing what it takes to make it work. That's the theme of this reading. Making it work, Capricorn. So let's pull some overall advice. I'm also getting like this person may own their own business, their own company. They may be the CEO. But I just feel like with this Ace of Pentacles, like they're building they're building something, building a career, building a business. And with this Ace of Pentacles being in the reverse for some of you, like this success was not given to this person. They had to work hard for it. Whatever success they have, um, whatever they have gained monetarily, like they had to work hard for it. Spirit, what overall advice do you have for Capricorn?
I have comfort. I heard be there for each other. Spirit says be there for each other. Be open with each other. Listen to each other. Communicate. Be there for each other. That's the advice Spirit has for you, Capricorn. So Capricorn singles, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone stay blessed.